guys, so today I want to do a model horse show guide sort of thing. And today I'm going to be showing you guys my live showing kit. Or like, basically, if you want to have a live showing kit, whenever you go to live shows, I'm going to show you what I have in mind. Maybe you can get inspired by something. So yeah, let's get started. So basically what I bring to, with me to every show is my showing kit. It has a whole bunch of supplies, just in case I need to do something last minute or... If, because I do that, I actually do that a lot. Um, or if I need something at the show and it's all right here. And here's a size comparison of mine to Brookside Pink Magnum. It's not like too tall and stuff, but yeah, you can use anything for a showing kit. I just use a small plastic bin thing. So, what's inside my show kit? Alright, so. In my show kit, I have references. This is where I keep all my references for my horses. If I, they, I usually, like, whenever a horse needs a reference, I just keep them all in here so I don't forget about it or I don't lose it. Um, I also have model horse tags, which are very important for shows. Um, here's an example of one. That's this girl's. Um, so, yeah, um... It's actually pretty important for shows. Not all shows use these tags. Some use a card system where like instead of having the tag, they'll have the horse out and then they'll have like a card saying like breed and all that stuff. So yeah, just be aware of that. But I do recommend getting tags. Um, I also have a pencil in here just in case to write some notes down. I do bring a notebook as well just to like record notes and stuff and record placings just to keep track of it. So, yeah, um, I recommend bring a pencil. Um, I also have an assortment of Sharpies. I have gray, black, and brown. You don't exactly need these three colors. Just do whatever you want. Um, I use these to fix ear, um, ear rubs or hoof rubs or scratches that are really last minute. I didn't see them till before they went on the show ring. Um, it's really helpful, too, because, like, you can't guarantee what's going to happen to your horse whenever you travel with them. So, that's why I always bring it just in case. I don't always recommend Sharpie, but, like, it's if you're, like, already at the show and you notice something, then these are pretty helpful. Um, I also have brushes. Um, show judges, they look for dust on models. And if they see dust on a horse, they aren't very happy with it. And I can't guarantee it will place. So what I have is I have a tiny brush. My camera won't focus because it's stupid. But... It, like, helps out with, like, small areas. And I have another size brush that's a little bit bigger. But, like, it's helpful for, like, traditionals and stuff. I use this for stable mates, too. Then I have this one that gets, like, a larger amount of dust off. I also have a highlighter in here because I bring a show packet with me. And I just highlight some notes and stuff that I need to know regarding the shows. Um, I don't use this very often, but I use these to, like, label tags. Just to, like, if it's my horse, I'll say it's this. I don't recommend using this all the time because some judges don't like it. It just really depends on the show, but I have it just in case. Um, it's not required, though. If you're planning on showing at Briarfest 2014 and a children's or youth show, there's a rule regarding that you have to use ribbon to identify your horse, put it on their legs, their neck, their tail, etc. If you're going to Briarfest and you're showing it, I recommend putting this inside your show kit just in case, because if, if the horse loses the tag or something, or the ribbon piece, then you'll have extra with you. So that's what's in my show kit. If you want me to do any other videos regarding model horse showing, please comment below. And if you want to see anything certain about model horse showing, just please comment below. And one more thing, if you want me to do a Briarfest showing guide, uh, please comment below. It'll be for youth and children's show, but mainly youth, because that's all I've done so far. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Ah, oh, folk camera! Don't you dare do this to me. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Don't do it. Okay, good. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!